Hey everyone, Gator Mom here. I'm doing a review today on the Jujube Super B. And this is a bag that I've reviewed a couple times now on my channel, but today we are going to a friend's house for a pool party slash play day kind of summer get together. So I have my Super B packed up with fuel cells today. I do this often and I know it's kind of a hot topic sometimes on the Jujube chat pages on Facebook. Um, a lot of you are always curious as to how many fuel cells will fit in a Super B or how many quicks. So I thought it would be a fun review to show you guys how I have mine packed up with using the fuel cells. So this is the Admiral print and I have it paired here with a First Mate messenger strap. I love using messenger straps on my Super Bs and I'll sometimes use um, custom seatbelt straps or the um, sold separately messenger straps that you can buy from Jujube. I happen to like this particular combo a lot. I think that it pairs up really nice. So I have the first mate strap on there. And then on the front of the Super B here, there's these three pockets. The one all the way over here on the right of the bag. I have my um, iPhone 6 Plus, and this is just a regular kind of slim case in there. So for size reference there. And I have a booty pod with a um, mixed nautical booty pod cover with the first mate and the Admiral again. And in here, I just have my wet ones. And then I also have tucked in this pocket my Honest Company hand sanitizer spray. Nothing else in that pocket. In this middle pocket here, it goes about half the length down here as far as size of this particular pocket. And there is a zipper at the top. I meant to actually unzip that before I got started. Oh good, there we go. Inside that zipper, I just have a couple things I grab for my Posh um, Mega Lip Plumper. This is just a really good chapstick I've been using like crazy this summer. And then I have a pack of gum and a pack of Tic Tacs in there. So nothing else in that little pocket at this time. Again, it goes down to about that halfway mark there as far as the length of the pocket. This pocket over here, I just have my wallet. This is a large zip Kate Spade wallet. I love the color. I'm actually not sure what this particular color is called, but it's a really pretty kind of minty teal color. So I have been using that a lot. And then inside here, I won't um, bother to show you, but I do have a Jujube B tag that has my splash pad passes and um, Science Center passes, things like that. So that fits nicely in there. Nothing else in those front pockets. In the back of the bag, actually, I'll show you really quick before I get on the inside of it. I don't have anything in this back zipper pocket besides a little um, lovey for my son. It's an Aiden and Anais Muzzy blanket, so it's about half the size as a regular swaddle. When I pack my Super Bs pretty full with um, interior pouches like fuel cells or quicks, this pocket tends to get a little snug back here. So I just use it as a catch-all. I've been throwing just some toys back here for the kids or whatever I need to throw in there. So it's just empty at this time. Um, like I said, just that little blanket back there. Now I will turn it back around and show you the inside. I went ahead and unzipped the top because I knew I would be fumbling with that zipper while I'm holding the camera. Attached over here to the zipper pull is a great little custom fob made by Andrea. It has a little anchor on it. So I like that on the zipper pull there. And then I'll open it up nice and big for you guys. The lining of this um, nautical admiral print is so pretty. I don't even know if you can, those of you that haven't seen it in person, but it's this, this really pretty toasty gold color. I just, I love it. I think it's one of my favorite Jujube linings. Attached to the little key leash here, I just have my car keys, and then I have a little custom pouch that my friend Jamie made. And in here, you can store earbuds or an EOS lip balm. I just have my pill case. If I can get it open there, yep. I just have my pill case, I have a little chapstick, and then I have hair ties in there also. So here is what the inside of it looks like. I have three fuel cells, and then I have a little custom wipes case over here, and then a few things in these front pockets as well. So I'll kind of go around what I have in the bag, and then I'll pull each fuel cell out and show you guys what I have packed up in there. In the two mesh pockets here, which is divided by a seam down the middle, I just have in this one over here my Lush Be Mine. I love this. This is one of my favorite Jujube pieces that I have. The Lush pattern is an oldie but goodie by Jujube, and I just love it. So I was lucky enough to find one of these Be Mines, and I've been using it a lot as a first aid kit. I like using them for that purpose. So in here, I'll just show you very briefly. I have some eyeglass cleaner for my daughter and I. In the zipper pocket, I have a bunch of Band-Aids. I have some travel scissors, and then I just have a bunch of first aid stuff, like some 
sunscreen stick and some off my posh healer stick. This is my um, nail clippers, some Neosporin to go, some um, Benadryl anti-itch cream. So it's just kind of a little mini first aid on the go pouch. And then right next to it, I have my Honest Company sunscreen. And over here in this pocket, I have a custom pouch. This is a Quicklet, and in here I have all of my mommy things. I have my uh, Kleenex back there, and I think I have something else behind here. Let me open it and give you guys a view from the inside here. I just have a couple of these body cooling cloths. They're like powder cloths some more eyeglass cleaner, and then some Visine, my posh little It Girl perfume roller, and some lip gloss, and just a bunch of mommy things in there. It's a great little pouch. And then right next to that, I have my posh hand cream. And that's it as far as those two front mesh pockets there. In the back here, I have a um, custom wipes case, and this has a full pack of wipes. I believe it's, oh, I'm not even sure how many is in there, but it's a big pack of the Target brand wipes. So I have that in an Admiral case. And then in this zipper pocket back here, I'll show you before I get on into the fuel cells. I have a couple of busy things for my older two kids, just in case they're sitting around and maybe waiting to have a snack and they get bored and want to draw. I just have a notepad for each of them. And then I have some crayons in these little Q-tip containers. So that's just kind of back there for um, to keep them busy if they need to do something quickly. So then on to the fuel cells. I have three fuel cells in here, the Admiral, I have a Tokidoki Siamo print, and then the first mate. So I'll go ahead and just pull one out at a time and show you what's inside of it. I can back up here. In this Admiral one, I have a change of swim clothes for my, or actually, I'm sorry, and this one is a change of clothes for my older two. My um, oldest son and daughter will actually be heading over there in their bathing suits. So this is a change of clothes for them when they get out of the pool. And then in this particular fuel cell, I have a bathing suit for myself and the baby in case we want to get in the pool. So that's kind of the difference as to what I have packed up in here. But right on here on top, I have a a uh, little wet comb for my daughter. That's just for when her hair gets all wet. And then I have a posh healer tin. I use that for diaper rash. And then I have a wet bag in there. And I just have a little onesie for the baby if he needs a change of clothes and a diaper. And then I also have in here a change of clothes for my four-year-old. So these are in size 4T. If I can pull them out here for you. Yep. So that's just a little t-shirt and a pair of undies and a pair of shorts for her to change into. And then I have an outfit for my oldest son and these are size six. So they fit perfectly in a fuel cell with all that other stuff. I have a pair of shorts for him and a pair um, and a top in there for him as well. So that's in that first or Admiral fuel cell. Then inside the Siamo one, I love this print. I think it's so fun for summer. It's probably my favorite Tokidoki print. Inside here, I have a bunch of toys and snacks. I didn't pack too much food in here because there will be food there already and towels also there'll be towels there so i don't have any of those packed in here but i just have a couple of things more so for the baby in case they don't have anything that is conducive to what he eats so i just have my son's goggles in here and then i have a couple of little mermaid toys for my daughter she doesn't swim too much she kind of hangs out on the side of the pool so she likes to play with these little um, dolls if you will and then I have another little custom pouch here and in here I just have a couple of snacks for baby like I said in case they don't have anything that he likes to eat I just have some crackers and fruit, fruit snacks and some of these little graham crackers and just a bunch of snacks that he likes in there and then I have his water cup there and another little snack container with some dry cereal and um, goldfish and stuff in there so that's kind of an all-purpose bag there for toys and snacks and then the last thing I have packed in here is my first mate fuel cell. And in here, I just have, like I said before, a um, change of wet clothes for myself if I want to get in the pool, as well as the baby. Just in case we decide after we get there that we do want to get in the pool, I want to be prepared, but I don't think we'll be swimming. But um, this is just a um, little Johnson's hand and face wipe. And then I have a swim diaper for him. I actually have two. I have a little rash guard and then a little pair of shorts. And these are an 18 month. And then I have my swimsuit bottoms and top in there as well. And that fits perfectly in that fuel cell. I really like how it's packed up in there. So that is everything that I have packed up in here. Oh, I also have another little um, custom pouch made by Jamie. And I just have hair ties in there for my daughter and I if um, I happen to need an extra one. 
So that is everything inside the Super B and how I have it packed up for a morning out over at a friend's pool with fuel cells. So I hope you guys found this review helpful. And if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. And as always, I appreciate you guys watching and don't forget to subscribe.